Hello YouTube, uh, I have a Depstech DW49 web camera and what I was experiencing was that uh, whether I was inside of Zoom sessions or just online in general, um, sometimes in Microsoft meetings, the camera would just kind of wig out when I was doing recording sessions and um, I was getting to the point where I was about ready to just chuck the camera and uh, it's kind of a last ditch effort. I went out to their website and I discovered that this particular camera does have a flashable memory and the version of the memory that I had was the old version. Uh, so I went ahead and I downloaded the new flash update and it seems to have straightened everything out. Uh, I'm on a Windows 10 PC. I haven't upgraded to 11 yet, but I figured if you are experiencing this problem, I'm just going to go ahead and walk you through um, all the particulars about how to upgrade the flash. So uh, with that, I'll go ahead and switch on over to my phone for a second and then we'll just record the camera itself. Okay, so here's the webcam and what I'm going to do is I'm just going to show you the model number in case you are wondering yourself if I have the correct model. Uh, so what I'll do is I'll flip it on over and the text is really tiny and I've got this wonderful little light that will allow us to zoom on in. There you can see it's model DW49. All right. Let's go take a look at the website and show you what to do next. What you'll want to do first is go to the Depths Tech site. So it's depthstech.com and then go to Pages, Downloads. And then once you're on there, you're going to see a web page that's got three tabs on the top. Click on the one that says Webcams and then go down to the DW49. Uh, from the TW49, the thing you're going to want to do is download this tool here, the Webcam Upgrade tool, and then go up and download this. This is the actual image. Uh, DW49 black 60 hertz. So get both of these, right? Um, don't bother with the video because it's literally the, the crappiest directions I've ever seen. Um, go here and um, to your downloads. And then once you've downloaded the actual file, click on the upgrade tools. All right. Um, what you want to do is you want to erase the flash first. So click on the erase, it'll process the erase. And uh, I'm just going to do that for you right now. All right, so you see how I have the success message? Now, the next thing you're going to do is go back over to the downloads. You're going to grab, I in this case, I'm going to select the 60, 60 hertz what's one, and I'm going to drag it on over. And so you see how it just dumped it right inside of my downloads, right? Okay, so once I've got that, all I have to do is click the download button. All right, I have a success message, right? That means we're all done. Okay, so I can close out of that. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to test my camera out and you'll be able to see this real time after I just flashed it. Just drag this over here so you can see it. There we go. It was that simple. So I hope that works for you. Take care.